definitely still a really nice ride with these tires. All right, I got my Polaris parts. Uh, these two should be the new bumper extension that basically covers the headlights. And I got inch and a quarter spacers for the new tires. So uh, let's get to work. Here's a before look, before the spacers. Well, this is really uncool. It's supposed to be a set of four. I only got two. Oh, come on, man. You gotta be kidding me. Alright, uh, here's the after look. Uh, honestly, I can't even really notice them sticking out anymore, which is kind of what I had hoped for. So, I got the two uh, spacers in front. Gonna have to wait on the back ones, but let's take it for a ride, see if this cures the rubbing or not. Let me show you what I got here. So I, I took an angle grinder and cut this little section off. The good news is that right underneath, which I can't see, but it's uh, you can see there's a two bolts there, right in that specific spot. So that'll keep that shield in place. So we'll try this next, and I may get bigger spacers. But let's see how this works first. All right, we're going to try the spacers and a final sound test. Turn that off so we can hear. I can't feel or hear anything. So I'm just chewing on the options and maybe maybe I'll go for a lift kit instead of the other two or three different options. Just maybe a two inch lift kit. I'll chew on it for a little more yet. Okay, so as many of you know, there's actually several options you could do to attack this situation. Uh, a, wheel spacers, which is what I'm going to do. Uh, B, you could do forward A arms that basically push the tires forward a couple inches or a lift kit. Um, the lift kit I'm not going to do. I talked to the dealer today because it could potentially void the warranty. The forward A arms, I just didn't want to do that and push them tires forward. It, it may or may not be an issue or not. Um, so I opted with ordering another set. I wanted one and three quarter inch because I didn't want to get out too far. But the only options, at least with the brand that I liked, was 1.5 inch or 2 inch. So I opted for a 1.5, 
and I'm going to leave it where it's at. I could still take the shocks up another two, two notches. So let's wait for the 1.5s to come in and then go from there. So here's a look at how the uh, headlight covers are going to go. Obviously it's not connected, but it looks good and it will be very functional. So here's how they fit in. First you have this uh, angle end, if, for lack of a better term, it bolts through here on the end and then that slides like so, okay. And then you've got a bottom bracket that fits in here. It's really tight in here though, spacing. Um, let me show you that bracket. So here's the bottom bracket. You gotta get that underneath and then get up these screws in there to line up and then cinch it down. And then I think cinching this is probably the last step, but I am reading the instructions. And these don't line up that well. They're actually, didn't line up very good, so I had to pull and flex this metal just enough to get these uh, bolts started through. But it should fit great once it's all together. All right, and then the final piece, this is an adapter for the uh, front cameras for the North Stars. Uh, the original one just goes straight across, which would block your camera. So this is an extra piece you have to order extra. It's all still loose, but it here it's together. Now it just needs to be snugged down, and it's going to be good to go. There's the final look. Man, that's tough looking, man. I really like it. And, of course, it's functional. Um, the reason I went with that is because I didn't realize these headlight assemblies are like $1,700. So this cost me the upper part like $350, $360-ish. A worthwhile investment, if you ask me. So now I just got to get the tires and the clearance ironed out and then it should be ready i don't know what i'm going to do if i'm going to do a lift kit if i'm going to do bigger spacers exactly yet but i'll figure it out I mean, definitely still a really nice ride with these tires Over here by the 